Google Glass is the internet search engine giant Google's latest invention, combining glasses with a mobile computer, which connects to the internet and can snap photos, initiate video chats, display directions at the sound of a user's voice, and bring up information that only the wearer can see. But the new device has many people worried about the repercussions for privacy. The fact is, if you're out with friends, if you're at the family dinner table and you've got your Google glasses on, you're not paying attention to what's happening. So that's the largest problem. There are also big issues of privacy. So the fact that you can be recording and photographing things without people realizing it presents all sorts of ethical issues for the people in your surroundings. If you're walking into a situation where you wouldn't bring a camera, either a still camera or a film camera, then you should not have the Google glasses recording. You also shouldn't have them on. Because the people around you, again, are going to be wondering, what's going on there? Is this person recording? It puts people very ill at ease. It's, it's akin to putting on a pair of sunglasses, where you're actually putting up a barrier between you and the person around you. So again, anywhere where you'd bring a camera, and that would be off limits, I would say the same for Google Glasses. Take them off and turn them off. News website Mashable launched a video on its site showing the possible misuses of Google Glass that it calls Glass Hole. Mashable's editor-in-chief Lance Ulanoff, who has used Glass, said that it should be used with a clear purpose in mind. I think that, you know, if you're going to wear Google Glass, you want to wear it almost with a purpose. Like, what's it going to do for you? It's going to help you get where you want to go. It's going to give you information on the fly. But if you're going to a party, do you really want to wear them? You're going to be interacting with all these people you ostensibly know. So maybe that's a time to put aside glass. Google is making the glasses available to software developers this year, but has said they won't be available more broadly until 2014, leaving humanity devoid of glass holes for just a little longer.